after I've downloaded the balloon attendance dot notebook file I'm going to click on Windows Explorer click on my downloads folder there's balloon attendance dot notebook I'm going to drag it to my desktop and close downloads and if I have a bunch of classes where I need to take attendance I'm going to make some copies of this file so I right click on it left click copy right click in a blank area of my desktop left click paste and just keep doing that until I've got enough files for all my classes then I would rename each file so I would click on this first one click on balloon attendance and I might rename it first period and then I might rename the second one second period and so on so I'm going to double click on first period to open it and I see a smart notebook page with a bunch of balloons on each balloon it says press edit arrows to edit text press balloon to pop so I'm going to click on the edit arrows which is they're small they're in the lower left area and now I click on the text and I get that green square I select the text and we'll name this uh, balloon Maria and then I go back and click on the edit arrows so that's going to be Maria's balloon and now I go to the next balloon click on the edit arrows click on the text select the text and we'll say that's going to be Jose's balloon maybe I wouldn't give Jose a pink balloon but I could fix that later and then I would go through and uh, name each balloon for every student in this class and I would want to click file save and now I would have this smart notebook page on my smart board when students came into the class and when Maria came into the class she could go up to the smart board and tap Maria's balloon and pop it and I would know that Maria is in attendance that day Jose could do the same thing and then to restore the balloons you just tap on the outline of the balloon again and it comes back and then you click file save and you're ready to take attendance the next day if you don't need every balloon point at a balloon right click on it and left click delete if you need more balloons point at a balloon right click on it and left click clone and then drag the clone balloon to where you want it to be when you drag it it will pop but just click on it again to restore it and then click file save 